Alright, so... This is a piston to a Tahatsu TLDI air compressor. And the rings were stuck on it. I tried to get the rings out, they broke, but one side of the rings are stuck in the piston. And the walls of this is the cylinder head or the bore of the compressor and you can see it's all scored because this compressor was overheated um, <clears throat> this little fitting was broken off and so it wasn't getting cold but it was still getting oiled so the bottom ends good this is the bottom end like the crank of the compressor so I'm I'm rebuilding this I already ordered the parts so I ordered new gaskets and the new piston rings the pistons still good and the rod is good the bearings are all good <coughs> um, but I have everything sitting here I'm just waiting for the parts but uh, this is the part of the head the, the valve um, this compressor was only making 50 psi of air pressure and it was supposed to be making about nine uh, 80 to 80 to 90 and the engine would run but it was not running good this is a, a 2004 Tahatsu TLDI 90 um, so I just wanted to make this video to show you maybe save some people some money because this if I were to buy this new it would be about 800 bucks which is crazy and for I I literally spent 30 bucks on parts and I I'm gonna hone I'm gonna hone this cylinder and I'm gonna put it all back together and I bet you that this this uh, compressor is gonna work like new it's gonna build more pressure and you know for 30 bucks rather than 800 you know so there's not a lot of information online about these uh, motors so I'll give you guys an update when I get done with it and put it back together to make sure it's working properly but you know if you you're probably frustrated if you have one of these motors because it's so hard to find parts and you know information on them um, I'm kind of learning that you know now I wish I would have known that before I bought it but you know it is what it is I want this motor to run good so I'll make another video to update you when I'm when I get the parts and everything and I get this put back on the motor but thanks for watching